I thought it was going to get here. But, I'll keep your secret. Ladies and gentlemen, it's I, the Terror of Norris, who go back to West Alaska Academy. I can book heroes where I want, it's my LP. Do you want to play the game yourself? Download the link is in the description. But it's too long because YouTube likes to shorten the, descri the descriptions, and, you know? YouTube's weird that like that. No, Hana was... My was Hana's friend. She, if I want to tell Satch... If I want to tell Satch, that was her business. Not Hana's. I won't tell anyone unless you want me to. My hero stuff around her desk in Hana's arms. Oh, no problem. No, really, thank you. I know things are bad now, but we're on each other's side. As long as you're right, nothing else matters. You're right. So I near the end of lunch, Mai stood up and took and took her tray. No, the tray. I'll take these back. Oh, thank you. No problem. She left. This up the Kawaii measured march. She seemed to be feeling better. Maybe everything will work out. I hope so. One by one, students first into the classroom. I kept her eyes on her desk, running across the crews of the warm wood. What did it feel like to run her hands across it? She tried to find out, but it was too afraid to move. Huh? She finished the sound of her name on other students' lips. She used several pairs of eyes with a thick on her face like a ray of sunlight. She didn't look at them. She couldn't look at them. She was just really ranged, ranged, and looping and swirling around. If it were a crayon, she probably playing. If it can, she probably playing through it. But it's made of marble, so I can't wait. Probably weren't looking at her. Now you could. She was imagining all of this. We're well, marble at one point, but it looks and feels like marble. So it is marble. Yeah, yeah. How stupid of her! Is this she was the center of the world? Silly Anna. She stole, but she looks so docile. This is way too familiar. So I felt like I had a different mom was no longer tethered to her body. Instead she was floating up on the of the room from, play, from the place people feel when they roll their eyes on the back of their heads. I never want to do that and I don't want to. For your scene play up before her. Those selfish, think you're better than us? No. Look at this girl. Who does she think she is? Say something! She's carrying the floor beside her desk. She's right after school. She comes to the classroom to get textbooks she got and ran into three girls. The three girls used to be her friends. I test, didn't you? No. I did, why would I? Who did you tell the class then? How'd you manage to catch now his boyfriend, eh? People sleep around, haven't you? No, I haven't. Yes, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> why? I wonder too. Her mother was around to teach her proper manners. Huh. I don't want to tell her how to sleep around. How do you see her father? Ah! She was standing. Book she threw there on the opposite side of the classroom. Now we have a duck to avoid it. Isn't this that bad of a fear? We must have started laughing. Oh, wow, well, you're right. A bad start of a bad family. Who never meant too much. That's right now. I think I'll tell the principal what happened. Oh, I'm sorry. Please don't. I don't want to clean up for us then. I think we lost him because of the student actors. I also took your friends, but I wouldn't lie about this. I moved these utility classes back to the room and got the broom. Had a girl. She turns away from mother after all. <gasps> That's the type of stuff that actually does happen. I never had that problem. I never did. Cause you mess with me, you had to mess with the football jocks and the hockey jocks. You don't want to mess with two different kinds of jocks. If one is in the video, if you're afraid of one, you'll be afraid of the other. It's good to have lots of friends in places of power, let's say. Anyway, Hunter, are you okay? I'm shaking. I hope it wants to respond when you. 
for her teeth to start chattering. Chris, you're going to. How raise your hand? Anna, what is it? Bathroom. Emergency. Please. Alright, but think about it. She has a drawer full of those who's moving through it. Ether? Here we go, guys. You move lost away. She shouted behind her. <coughs> How I passed for her a bore. What she could hear was the sound of her breathing and the blood pounding in her head. Mr. Quickglass told her it was empty. All stalls, to all stalls, to all stalls. She sort of rushed inside the door and closed in the end of the toilet. Then she sat, pulling her knees up to her chest. Hey. Hate this. Deep breaths, huh? Deep breaths. Calm down. You're in a She's in the bathroom. She's in the You're in the bathroom. You're asking him. It's sort of hard sometimes. Look, uniform's different. The door's locked and no one's going to go in like last time. They're safe. Calm down. Deep breaths. Tyler breathes, her eyes blattered across the stale gray tile, thick metal walls separating the stalls. They judged her from her old school. Remember to do graffiti on the backs of the doors. Remember would tell you what people know she was she and Bobby will be together forever now. I should know this reference, but I don't. Hi, <laughs> Hales. What's good, huh? This is the world. Sure, this is a bad bit. You're my best friend. Your score. That's incredible. Well, hi, I know you're another person. <laughs> I've already changed. But I'm so, so. So, uh, what am I even doing here? Kind of asked himself, he didn't want to say about me. So, I don't know what. Must be it for the rest of your life? There's always a little slice of me to you. You born in hide? You start crying over something? You fall on your stead? What are you doing with yourself? This can't, this won't be my future. She ought to push open the door of the bathroom, so her face, tears stained and pink, stood back in front of the mirror. I'm going to change. Now I'm taking matters in my own hands. I'm gonna find the boots. I'll clear my name. My eyes too. I'll find the books of Satch. Look at me, and I've been letting him take everything upon himself. Who does he have? Who does he have when they go bad? Who is someone people can lean on? Who is someone who can actually help other people? She rinsed her face in the sink and dabbed with a rough paper towel. The time things change. Show back to the classroom. Show us where her eyes turning straight ahead. She took a pause to actually wait for her to take her seat. This time she see those students' heads turning, following her moving across the classroom. She ignored them. She says, Look at her again. So smile on her face. Her back to her, my taps, tap on her shoulder. You okay? Should have been. Yeah. Better than ever. Smell watch watched for a few seconds. She had to put as much of a resolve into her eyes as she could. As she could. She could do this. Finally, she nodded and she turned to her classwork. First, she had to get through class. That's that. The library. Be strong, Hannah. She said the library. So I dumped some old books in the little side, tucking her clothes. Puffins and clothes too, with their heads, with their heads hung over their over homework. She went straight to the front desk. Sat so behind it, searching for her something in the piles of papers stacked on the back wall. She kept shaking his head and pausing. I want to see who invited herself. His hands over his hair. It was odd. He looked really stressed. This was normal for him. I also wanted up, but she came here for a reason. Excuse me? He jumped slightly. Oh, Hana. How can I help you? Well, you smiled and almost seems something was wrong, even though that clearly wasn't the case. The strangest thing was that the smile was disingenuous. He was always truly smiling, happy and excited about something. Sasha so never has help, even if he needed it. You're right, you don't seem very well. Sasha so glanced down before applying a little whisper. What books have gone missing? Oh. Mine's not due for another week, few weeks, so we saw the one hurting you this time. He just fell flat as a dead raccoon. Sasha's face caved in, he stared at the counter in front of him. It's. It's not looking good for me. What? What do you mean? He opened his mouth but didn't speak. After a pause, he began to chew his lip. Something strange happened. 
He almost gathered himself up, took a breath, and said so his back and smiled. Don't worry about it. It made Hal's heart break. She wanted to crawl around the counter and give him a hug. She wanted to feel the weight of his head against her shoulder, something to help him unload the burdens he carried. But as she went to the smile, she realized he didn't want her to. More than that, he didn't want her to. Maybe if she were Jared or Paul, but not Hannah. Not right now, at least. Maybe if I thought they were close enough to share some of their burdens, close to the burdens, but now? So I struggling, I didn't trust her enough to let her see it. Heart dropped, her neck blew hot. I was really not supposed to worry about it. They had the hands as if, as if swatting away a fly. It'll be fine. No. Well, I had no doubt that you'll be fine on your own, but. It was now or never. Maybe he didn't want her help, but he still needed it. It's probably a second. Try to find the best things reward her intentions. You're only trying to help me. You have so much on your plate. What's all you do is help you find some books. Two heads are better than. No, really, that won't be necessary. Why not? You have a reason. I'm here for a reason. I have a friend. I want to help you, Satch. That's what he's But he didn't trust her, did he? I'm not going to give up on this. Really, Han, I was very kind to you, but. He looked around, he looked around him in desperation. I don't think that would be helpful. Please, let me handle this. I I, I, don't know, I swear. But, such cross over his shoulder. I mean it. I gotta get to work. I'll see you later. Says I'm behind the counter right in the back room. I have waited there. I'll still look on her face. I turn her back to think how it looks. How what? So I did want your help. Was it kind of bad for herself on them? Yes. The question was, did you not want her help? If she was sure it was because he didn't want to read it. It's because for all he said he believes he did. She didn't do it. Boots. He didn't trust her. Not at all. Telling him that it helps him do anything. He's got to tell me if that's what he thinks. Since he was done, it was best for him. Of course, she was assuming. She knew better than he did about what he wanted, but she had to do something. It wasn't just going to sit around and wait while he was in trouble. Something good for, for something good for her. Whatever that meant, she wanted to make sure it didn't start looking any worse. And there, to the bl the blades and scissors. She had a small book shaped clap fell into her lap. She the piles rolled out on her shoulders, finding four hundred pounds of multicolored cheese papers that lay before her. She tried to so much at once. She set it aside and grabbed the print marker that sat on her desk along with the cloud shaped dark ring she had earlier. Hey, I'm back. My face flushed and cheery as usual, bowed into the room. Hey. How's practice? Why would the practice the Alaska Strikers almost every evening? This game is clear, but it was not the it was out of school, so she was able to go see her play. Probably had a lot, but she was slightly if not to have to witness the pyre bring rays that was my playing volleyball. It's fine, but I totally struck me in the uh, what's all this? My daughter was making in her chair, surveying the mouse papers battle on the floor with Hannah at the center. <laughs> you know we had to some cows here. Well, you can fly, actually. Would you want to have me? It'll take me a few hours by myself. Of course, what are they for? She found herself on the floor and took one of the stick figures on the maid. Two books got missing in the library, so I figured we could put a prize around you return there at the time. Oh, missing books? How's Susie's paper? Mine tells Susie's. Hana tells Susie's paper at her feet. Then I can have glue stick and start attaching the images. Yeah, they missed it a few years ago, but now it's getting worse. Well, the books just well, I forgot to turn it in, so I figured maybe that happened with all the books. Mouse spell is sticking in your hands, so it looked like it was doing cartwheels. They had a couple with who was the books in the system, you know. Yeah. Maybe it'll help anyways. I got to have a book and spear go off on the back. People just forget, so maybe half can be mine and half can be lost. Found notes. Yeah, okay. Then they were through a pile of papers each. They were in handwriting, so P is the nicest fire. How to work, of course. 
Right here in kindergarten, it was Ali Company. There are images of books, and when she was heading, I put her markers to start drawing them when she sat today with the back of her hand. Oh, shoot. God, that's something in the gym. I should go get it. Okay, be right back. Yeah, no problem. I still might have missed something. Usually she might have out something when she wanted to copy Paul's homework. As she stood on, as she stood on the third pile, she began to go distinctly sad. Why? Hands to the paper, very strange in her mind. Back in our Risu, Paris and I talked together. We actually beautiful works of art, pottery, strands, and her mom filled them with the flowers she grew. She tried to teach her to make pots, but she could never do it. She got too nervous seeing how easily one mistake could be also what she were making. Yeah. So one day, he came to her room with a pile of papers. For the second, the woman wanted to go appear in front of her eyes. How do you do that? So I handed her a pair of top how to fold the morning boy step by step. When she finished, they sat them side by side. Who was crumpled and stunted next to his crisp, beautiful creation. But he laughed. Separate, now they'll be considered beautiful. I will wait. Fun of her set of blue morning boy, the cover of books sticking out of one panel. So she made her way through the pile of flowers and then the next. Shadows grew longer and longer until they faded altogether. When she finally finished, it was after nine, and Maya still hadn't returned. Yeah. Done! She went really back on the floor, exhausted and glanced at the clock. She didn't take her long, this time she to the gym. She ran into someone? She left her. She had to get up early. She cleaned up, changed to her pajamas, and crawled into her snow school sheets. The while snoring, the room seemed intensely still, like the sounds of trying to press stuff into her skull. I hope she's okay. They don't bore her as she takes off to sleep. Mm, what? Uh, what's happening? She couldn't see. Her eyes wouldn't stay open. So late. Hi. She closed the door to turn over to her desk. She was being so damn loud. She turned over, vaguely angry. Too tired. Lots of sleep. The slip paper echoed from her side of the room. Quiet. The drawer shut. My got to her bed and the mattress over her head say, over her head say. She got to the clock and it was past midnight. She only just got back? Something seemed wrong. School wasn't in session right now. What? She couldn't think straight. Head to the pillow and she turned over, drifting off to sleep again. Very right next morning, she scurried to the hall, searching for Satch. Ten minutes before he went to class, there's no way she could show her face as she was faster than with some hating her. Her heart was comforted with a with a flash of bright yellow. Hey, Anna, what are you up to? Cast it in front of her, his head tilted to one side. I didn't know until, in fact, this was probably the first time they ever spoke on their own. Hey. Okay, have you seen Satch? He was up before. Something wrong? Don't be as far as I want to give them to him. Saw the power papers she was holding. They were nearly as tall as her torso. Can't believe I've seen them for the first time. Cool. It's not likely. I'll pause. Is something wrong? He does have his jack pockets with us in the hall. I don't say anything was wrong, per se. Shut off, we didn't volunteer any information. Again, he's acting weird. Is it about the tournament? In a way you could say that. Cast his eyes on the floor. Things probably don't look too good for us. That's too bad. He was truly sad, but she tried on a light, she couldn't hide her glee. He was her surprise and a sharp gleam entered his eyes. No thing is on the bag yet, Miss Bees, you know. We'll have you well we'll give you a Right and run for your money. <laughs> you say so. Going mad as she scraped past him up the staircase. He was starting to cramp. It wasn't that the flowers were particularly heavy, though they were known by, me, by no means light. They were horribly awkward to carry, especially up staircases. To the staircase, door open with her back and to the third floor. Crossing the hallway, she saw a figure standing in front of an open locker. Ha! Ha! She dashed, dashed, and dropped the pile of flies apart of him, heaving. 
I tried the stairs wasn't such a bad idea. Was he here? What was he here so early? Look. So far I shoved it into his face. Step back and appear at the right angle. Be a good date, don't you turn your books and wait. What is this? The fire type search for the missing books. Do I just keep working on this alone, so Oh uh, no. He created a scratch in the back of his neck. That's great, but I don't know if I'd really be happy with these. The high or whatever job she's doing. Oh. Show the stack of files on the floor, stretching her hands to ease their stiffness. Still, he went down foot through the sheets. Do you mean all these yourself? Yeah, that's right. Might help me too. Handwriting is really nice. Thank you. My hand got tired at the end, but though. But. And though. So I'm not sure the ones on the bottom are really good. She in his chest, as if we're looking out the window. Um. You know, I better find something to do with it, them, after, after all. Really? If you use them right, they may have just a library workload. Head is boomed in her in Hannah's chest. Yay. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Thank you so much, Hannah. Really, it means a lot. Head, does something to help you? The smile and reached a hand towards Hannah and just threw off her hair. But stopped mid gesture and said to her back to the locker. Well, I need to class every day, so I'll be seeing you. Alright, well have a good day. Hello, you two wanna make a couple sandwich. I remember because of the word, but I don't remember what it said. He just stack of fires and put them in his locker. They had left for a costume for the down the hall. It's not a watch the door closed, sure she hadn't been dis he hadn't been distant at all this time. The heart later than it was in days, she slipped down the stairs and headed to her home class. Time to make up the homework she didn't do last night. So she has four hours actually began to hit her. She's not handling back sleep well either. She was grumpy and irritable. In my recollection, this one all at her, she pulled right next to a few weeks ago. Gave her her respect. So after that class, it went just as expected. Those boys played her eyes the entire period. Then the case of Bob and Jesus in class from Shane. She seemed to be taking decisions much more seriously than the rest of them. And she had no idea why. She did anything to him, but for some reason he was never fond of her. Or her hair. His job will explain all of that. She was a little closer to John PBD though. She was at least quite in contact with him, but it seemed difficult for them to even look at her. She just better seem to be taking it hard. Yeah. He's a kind soul, and she didn't think he'd be able to continue isolating my and her if he didn't have others to support him. As it was, as it was, any time she actually comes past him, he seemed to be fighting an internal battle. But as much as class was his regret, sadness, disbelief, of course, he ended up turning around and heading back from he came. He had to class several times. Did they know more better than this? Didn't they know she would do something like this, that to them? What did they really have in common? A shared school, a tournament, possibly even a shared hobby? Fetch had meant different things to different people. To her, they were still her friends, but she guessed to them. She was back in the reality as the bell rang. He got shuffling the shadow students filled the room in a, in a rush to leave for lunch. B, Sean, and Shane. John and Shane. Nothing faster than she thought it would be possible. Who she had of walking into lunch to get a badge with them. They didn't want to be in her presence any more than they had to be. Signs so into bag shut, then she put a hand on her shoulder. Looking and stood behind her, gazing at her with sympathy. His book was pathetic. Ian was. Well, Ian was being Ian. Stoic. It was hard to tell what he was feeling with the face, as impassive and disdainful as his. What was the long face? Do you really have to ask? Nah, I guess not. Harsh wrote her, her bag in the silence that followed. She wasn't sure whether there was a point to this conversation. She just wanted to leave. You know, you don't need to worry. She was just there to roll her eyes. Don't I? Nobles Club are great people. People of job, be the first time of trouble. Look, I believe you're innocent, and because of that, I know they'll recognize it too. <laughs> just give them time. I mean, they can't all be as smart as me. He came like a proud school kid. How do you know I'm innocent? Look at that, I turned to Ian. Who could I missed? It's time to go. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. How does he know she's innocent? Do you just think that, or does he actually know? I don't know the answer, but, uh. We'll find the other room. What's fine? That was weird, are those two? It doesn't matter, does it? They're both pretty hot. 
I can't disagree with that because I have no problems on anyone in this game. Any hey, choices anyway. Is that all you think about? Bingo. Hey, I got something you guys put up in these dark times. Just has gone for drastic measures. Ha ah, shook her head. I think I may love lobster for lunch again. Yeah. I sure hope so. I've had lobster. It's expensive. This kind of problem how my stopped in her tracks. Oh shoot. What's wrong? How much money? Is my way here? I'm gonna run back and get it. That's okay. I want enough of the both of us. Really? Is it kind of a boost off you? Yeah. Sure. Why jump to his side, giving him a great big hug. How do you guys? I promise I'll pay you back. You better. It's like she afforded you handouts, especially not for us, because crazy expensive food. Come on, let's go. I'll tell you a secret in return. What's that? I suggest showing half of the helmets in all the entire of cannons. What? Tell she's off into space. Well, you're a space hamster. I mean, Chris found him in time and stopped him. I think he might keep the hamsters. I might think he has the hamsters too. Thank goodness. Maybe I think I'd rather tell the hamster to go home with creeps. That would be the nurse McPasta. Can't point there. Now you know what just cost me a hamster. <laughs> That's why I still have my appetite. Deal. The way they went for their food. Cars are several stairs shooting in their direction. Um, look, we got strawberry shortcake today. Sounds delicious. Yeah, great. She hated me. I can't be hated me to stare at. They got the food in their tr onto their trays and still walk to the back of the cafeteria where the table was not located. Why do those go sit in the middle of the cafeteria? They had to walk past them and everyone was watching. Try to concentrate on the smell of strawberries and ham wafting from a tray, but only found herself thinking of Jared's cologne. The ham, it's definitely the ham. Ugh, she had a grip. She passed some money out of the in the direction. No, I was looking. They were also getting roasted through chopsticks and spoons. Everyone except such. Send me to a table, something caught her, caught on his attention. She was fine about them. After a pause, Mr. Hidden Block Club joined in. Oh. My and Hannah smiled when they returned and sat down at the table with his two spirits. Now they looked at each the other, but they were thinking the same thing. No one's close to this side of the universe, and really, why did they expect anything different from them? So, you know, I've been thinking. That's a bad sign. Yeah. Rude. Who do you think would take the roots, and why? Noble Club is always universally beloved. Why is that? Why is that, anyways? Do you create hot men's job like you, best and girls? These are the math. That's why math is hard for me. Right, got it. Maybe I'm a crazy fan that took it then? She wanted to get their attention. She's not way to do it. They hate you afterwards. See, the opposite of love is a difference, not hatred. There has to be something in it for them. They don't think. Hey, block club? So at their table. There's him, Kelly beans and waves back. He didn't roll his eyes. How's that first? No, I don't think so. No one asked that, I thought they were. When well, someone changes their uh, demeanor drastically, they're hiding something. Always. Best remember that when your friend suddenly goes from being that. So he goes from being. Nice and polite, to rude and obnoxious. So I was hiding something. <laughs> but don't, but don't, but uh, don't stick your nose in a furnace. So yeah, that has to be me. Yeah. Okay, so they do. Plus the noble skies are their friends. <laughs> <laughs> this is locked up. So I had to access and no one was looking. Was school official? You think? Yeah, but they really hate everyone at school, and Satch in particular. Plus, it's just that creepy nurse. <laughs> there he is! There's a pasta. How are you today? Any new videos with me? I wouldn't know.
Or it wouldn't. Ugh, I've bothered him. Why is he wearing that mask? Heard he killed his cat, and now he thinks his soul is inside it. Heard he killed a cat, would he? How did he take the mask to him? Half his face is burned. Can we not reference games that have no plot? What? What? Ex-wife, try to kill him. Again, games no plot. You asked the direction. They said attention back to their food. Okay, let's pretend it's not him. There's no way I can... I can face that guy. Who has a word for hurting the robots club? We do. Well, no. Well, now we do. Not then. What about... Cloud Rail and Hush fell across the cafeteria. Well, he always came from the middle of the room. She is actually having some sort of disagreement. She was waving his arms wildly and pointing. Towards them? Seth shook his head. Vehem... Vehem... Vehemently. English. First language still incredibly hard. She was really shaking shorter, but she shook it off. Finally, he seemed to settle down. Just the before he said something to the rest of the group. Those who stared at him in shock. Then he paused, stashed together those things, and took leave of the table. He's not leaving the club? What? No way. That can't be right. Just so how serious stopped just over the table. He ate off him. He was so upset, though his question didn't suggest it. Might have put it here. Of course. Of course. Go ahead. Put it straight next to, next to Hannah, sat down and see his fish burger. He only looked at the picture of calm. It was only because he was sitting next to Hannah that she saw him slightly trembling. After all, Kazi started up again. Noble scouts looked more for his task, but no one made the move to follow him. Sass so ignored them. So. I think you understand. Thank you. I couldn't let this keep going. Friends don't do this. People shouldn't do this. I can't understand why, but the rain fear caused a compassion. I just couldn't do it. A small warmth bloomed within Hana, and tears put the back of her eyes. Um, who is it, do? Such an admire looked at him uncertainly. Well, I just have faith in you. Oh, well, good. In other words, I, tr I always trust you because this person trusts you. So if you're not trusting you, I'll stop trusting you. That is put pressure on whoever's in between. I think. Let's have something happier now. Now. How, uh, how about, how about, let's just pass comparatively out of that way. Hey, Buck. Guys, he said to pat on the back on the way out. This it's his caddy who shook his hand. Those of you who don't mind me. In Hana, sorry. Not me, I'm not here. Before the note, because I ended it. Like, well, I am here. I'm just watching from afar. I'm like, I'm like that guy in school you never notice. But whenever you notice him, he's always there. My day will not be changing for the break between this and the current LP, which would be staying at Stones. Do you imagine this is just happening in between? It's not actually kind of the main thing. Not kind of the main thing. That night, Hannah lay on her bed, watching the anime about doing the high school girls when they when there was a knock on a knock on the door. Do you know who that is? No. Oh well, you get it. Rude. Who's on her bed? Open the door. Hey, Hannah. Hey. Sash, what are you doing here? He's been her hope. Hop you over down like a kid in the music park. I want to show you. Will you come with me? Uh, sure. My high back good, okay? My gratitude in return. Chris Hatch and Han across the Wupa house. I worked on this a long time. We used a few years, but I think I finally made a breakthrough. Just out, but things have been kind of tensely, so I don't think I asked Jared to do it. Then I remember I had you, and you said you wanted to help me out, so I finally figured out something you could do. It's taken a moment and Hannah of Barrett what he was saying before they found themselves in his room. This is Spartan as she anticipated, being the love child of Jared and Satch. Yeah, Jared is out right now. That's why I came so late. Where is he? He had to go to see him for some reason. He did not look high about it. He was caused to put on a large blanket of lump. Here it is. A cliffhanger. See you next time.